So the latest update of Evolution X OS custom room is once again back. This one is 11.4 based on the latest security patch or latest security update of November 2025. Which are the things included with this new update, things to keep in mind and so on. So this is, a, this is the update available for few of the devices already. If it is not available for your device, it will be available soon. Let's have a quick look at some of the things included with this new update. First of all, you will notice that display refresh rate has a new UI. So refresh rate switcher basically has this new UI implemented. Not a major change, but it's available. So just wanted to let you know. Also, if you move on to ongoing progress chip, which was previously as status bar action chip, now it is renamed to ongoing progress chip and also has some more options to customize that. If you want to customize the standard chip position or circular chip position, you can customize it according to your own preference. And some of the useful things are also written there. So this might be useful for you. Another thing which I might have missed in my previous videos also regarding sidebar customizations that this is now included in this custom room too. It's not a unique thing, but it was available in few of the other custom rooms and now it is available in this case too. We have the option to customize the sidebar, you can change the position, you can customize the layout and so on. If you move on to quick settings panel like CR Droid and some of the other custom room, it also has the option to choose the quick setting tile shape to circle. So if you choose a circle tile shape, you also have the option to customize the rows and columns already and some more tweaks. Quick settings panel look good actually as compared to the previous one because of the circle tiles as you can see and you can make it look like android 11 style if you want to but in my personal opinion i don't think so i need it so i'm not going to use it but already android 16 quick settings panel has the option to customize and resize and so on one more thing is if you are looking forward to play protect certification device is certified so no issues here and this is by default I haven't done anything, any module and so on, so it's good. And also, as far as I know, uh, this is by default for everyone too. If you move on to play integrity API checker, it's three green ticks. We have basic, device, strong, all these things are green. No issues in play integrity at all. If you don't need it, you can even turn it off. I'll tell you later on for this one. Uh, if you move on to bootloader spoofing, it is also spoofed. Previously, when Evolution XOS was around three or four builds ago, maybe five builds ago, it, it these kind of spoofing was not there. The bootloader spoofing was never there, but from some time now, it is here. One more thing, if you have actually missed in previous videos also, that basic call recorder is included and it is implemented in system already. So, for example, because it has the Google Dialer pre-installed, if you don't want that call recording announcement, even not that beep, then you can use this thing basic call recorder and also install it as a magisk module if i'm using any other custom room circle to search as expectedly available working fine no issues in circle to search at all and by the way if it is not working for you what you can do is you can simply update the google app from google play store and done everything else is just kind of similar like if you move on to security and privacy options you'll see private space it is not missing from here it is working fine if you move on to these customization kind of things, Evolution XOS already have a lot of features and customizations. Right now, there are a lot of options available for you to customize in some custom rooms. In this case, we have the option for boot animation customizations and some of the boot animations are not present in many other custom rooms. So that's good. Other than else, things are kind of similar. If you move on to lock screen customizations like other, we have Pulse Visualizer, have the option for ambient wallpaper and so on. Status bar, kind of similar customizations. You just noticed ongoing progress chip, the option for quick pull down and so on. Quick settings panel, I've already told you. What about notification section or notification related tweaks? Simple, similar. Power menu, same options, miscellaneous. We have some spoofing options there and you can disable the force strong integrity if you don't need that. Uh, but everything else is just kind of similar. No storage restrict is there, application downgrade is there and so on so if you want to give it a try you can as i just told you it's available for few of the devices already officially for some other devices it might be available unofficially so this is it thanks for watching just wanted to let you know about this new update if you like this video make sure to drop a like and i will see you in the next one until then take care we'll see you in the next one